tired of having to adapt to my keyboard. Whether it's a mushy keyboard that came with the laptop, or it's a loud clicky keyboard that's breaking my eardrums, the keyboard should have to adapt to you. It works for you. Now, with uh, now the Age of Minority Report is finally upon us because the folks at Translucence have built a keyboard called the Luminate Keyboard Plus, where you type on a pane of glass with laser light projected onto it, and you can have any keyboard layout you want. You can put up a Dvorak keyboard or two giant circles and have it, and have it appear to you in any of 16 million colors to do your bid. So without further ado, I'm going to introduce Gary and Jason from Translucence. Oh, Gary and Mark. Mark and Jason from Translucence to, do, to show you this amazing device. It's also a pretty scary experience presenting a gadget to the world's biggest gadget fans, so please be gentle with me. You think this is just water. <laughs> so, well, well, my name is Mark Collins and I'm from Translucence, the Idaho-based makers of the Luminae range of keyboards and trackpads. I'm here today to dispel the myth that all Brits have bad teeth. <laughs> no, in all seriousness, I'm here today to introduce you to a very cool new keyboard. Actually, calling a keyboard doesn't really do it justice. It's a fully customizable interface device, and I also think a piece of art. Designed by my colleague here, Jason Giddings, a former aerospace engineer, the project originated on Kickstarter, where it achieved three times its funding goal and attracted the attention of some international investors. Some of you may recognize it from Kickstarter, and if you're waiting for yours to be delivered, we have not forgotten, it's not long now, and we will honor our commitments. We really got going when we received some three million in private equity funding from this Swiss software company, who have since become our partners for the software development part of the project, and who have been crucial in taking this from a small Kickstarter project to a fully fledged high end commercial product which will be released in March this year. This was actually our contract signing on top of a glacier in Switzerland, a day that I don't think any of us will soon forget. I'm the tall one there. Yeah. Well, I kind of regret wearing the South Park hat. <laughs> <laughs> If we can have the video on the keyboard. So what is the Luminae range and what's so special about it? Well, look at it. Apart from the fact that it's clearly the best looking keyboard, sorry, human interface device in the world, it's also an incredibly <coughs> functional product, which allows users to throw away the rule book when it comes to interfacing with their computers. Users can design their own keyboard layouts for use with specific applications, such as games, video, or photo editing, or anything else they can think of using a simple online tool. I use one of our prototypes at home, actually, to control my home theatre PC, as it's something I'm happy to have on my coffee table. Uh, and with our type and swipe technology, it's something, there's no need for a separate mouse or trackpad. You can simply control the mouse or use gestures right across the keys on the keyboard. Jason, do you want to rip it off? We can see here an example, or we will do in a second. You can see it, or we're about to see an example <laughs> of a, uh, a layout that Jason actually designed for the game EVE Online which is also a perfect example of how this product can be customized for any use, not just games, but for commercial applications too. Although I think maybe the defense customers might want to keep the launch missile button. So. <laughs> uh, as we've learned from visitors to our stand over the last few days, the only limit to the potential applications of this product is the imagination of the user. We're not going to tell you what to do with it. We're just going to enable you to use it in any way you want. If you can pop back to PowerPoint. Okay. So far we've had considerable interest from the scientific and medical community, mainly because it's the first keyboard that can be sterilized simply by wiping it down with alcohol. So unlike a traditional keyboard, it's not a petri dish of germs and bacteria. I can't deny it's been a very tough year turning Jason's dream into reality, 
But we hope you're all agreeing, the sleepless nights, blood, sweat and tears that have gone into this product have been worthwhile. We're very proud of what we've been able to achieve and we really hope you like it. Now, I believe we have a break after this presentation, so I'm going to go and calm my nerves in the nearest bar. And so if anyone likes to join me, Jason's fine. Yeah. <laughs>